All right, good afternoon, everyone. Today, we're gonna to be demoing uh, what is known as Total Expert Customer Intelligence combined with our journey automation. Uh, the number one problem we hear from lenders across the industry, they wanna be able to use data and automation to unlock opportunities and unlock new loans that otherwise would have fallen through the cracks and potentially hit the trash can. What we've done with this major product enhancement is we've natively brought in the most important insights, things like home equity, things like credit triggers, uh, things like a customer or prospect putting their home on the market. And we've allowed our customers to then customize an automatic workflow once those insights are surfaced as to what happens next. There's always been a disconnect between having data and intelligence on your customer. And what you need to do to actually deliver a great outcome for that customer in terms of getting them that next loan, helping them through the transaction. So Frank is gonna to demonstrate to you how we have built in customer intelligence right into our drag and drop, no code uh, journey and workflow automation tool, Frank. Absolutely, so our journeys are a way that we create an automated borrower experience at scale so your marketing team can deploy this on behalf of your loan officers. We have best practice journeys across that whole borrower life cycle from contact nurture, application pulled through, in process, and then customer for life, including customer intelligence. The key with these journeys are they're different than email drip campaigns because they're dynamic. They'll automatically start utilizing data from external systems. For a customer intelligence journey here, Joe mentioned our equity watch, MLS listing insight, and also credit polls. This will dynamically start a journey that will also humanize and personalize the content based on that data. For an equity watch example, we're gonna send out different content, whether that borrower's LTV is greater than or less than 78%. If that borrower is eligible for PMI drop off, we're gonna send email content that we provide to you as our best practice expert content, or you can bring your own content to be able to connect with the borrower on behalf of the loan officer without the loan officer having to lift a finger. What what the goal is, is ultimately, if you have best practices, how do you scale them across hundreds or potentially thousands of individual salespeople? And how do you get a consistent outcome? As an example, right, if you have a borrower that applies with you, uh, say three, four months ago, and uh, if you ask every salesperson, they would automatically believe that people are more loyal to them than they actually really are. So we believe using data and intelligence and combining that with automation to remind and, and really enable those loan officers to say, hey, by the way, somebody you pre-qualified to uh, four, three months ago is now cheating on you. They just pulled credit with a prospect or with a customer, uh, a potential other lender, and that customer is gonna be lost. So we surface what we believe are the best practices to then re-engage and capture that customer to capture that loan. So Frank, continue kind of showing some of the customization there and how we do that. Absolutely, those best practices not only include the emails, but also user notifications as you see here, SMS, text messages, and tasks. These tasks will all also include a call script. And while we give you the best practices that'll probably get you 85, 90% of the way there to be able to deploy and use this, any modifications utilizes a simple, no code, drag and drop solution that is intelligent enough to tell you what it thinks you're going to be doing next when you modify this journey. Maybe it's adding a task, sending a notification, or sending an SMS text message as I had mentioned. So we're not only providing you with the data in the form of insights, we're also providing you with the playbook and the content best practices. Yeah, and what, what our customers tell us is they want to be very nimble at how they address changes in the market, right? Market's volatile, rates go up and down. Uh, they want to be able to take a workflow or a journey and make adjustments without spending three, four months doing code and uh, architecting systems. They want to be able to very, very quickly execute uh, new types of journeys using data points and all in the spirit of ultimately unlocking volume that would have normally not been able to be captured. And here's an example of how we've built more intelligence into the platform. So not only can you use the insights, use the workflow, generate activity, but then ultimately see what's working and what's not. Also, one of the, one of the key components that we've learned when it comes to using data and intelligence to drive the business is there was a gap between actually getting the insight to a salesperson and actually getting them to take action. And one of the key things was they were being paralyzed by not knowing what to say. 
So such a simple thing as saying, hey, by the way, this customer's gonna cheat on you or this customer just listed their home, what we were finding is that salespeople were uncomfortable taking that action because they didn't exactly know what to say. So by building in the ability to deliver a call script when that insight or that signal happens, a call script to the salesperson says, here's what you need to do next, you take all the guesswork out of it, and now you've got that consistent process that, by the way, is built upon the most successful top producers. So we know what works, or your organization know, knows what works. Now you have the ability to assimilate that down through even the, your lower producers and your middle producers to, to really elevate how they go to, to market and take care of customers. All right, so switching over here, a core part of using customer intelligence and insights inside of Total Expert Platform is ultimately to drive the business. So how do you drive the business, not just using insights and signals, but ultimately getting your salespeople focused on the most high priority opportunities. So using external data signals like credit pulls, homes going on the market, maybe equity, you can customize at an enterprise level what's your highest priority, what's your ideal type of scenario for this subset of customers looks like, and then prioritize a view uh, so that when they log in, they have that exact focused list of customers. Frank, you can talk a little bit about how we've done that at Focus View. Absolutely, so this can be customized at the organizational, the team, or even down to the loan officer level to show you the most important borrowers. When your loan officer logs in, they have 10, 15 minutes in the CRM. We're not gonna expect them to spend all day in Total Expert. We're gonna show them the borrowers closest to the dollar. Somebody like Ciara here, who's part of that credit alert journey, she pulled credit with another lender. She's trying to cheat on you. We're going to not only show your loan officers why she appeared here, also all of the previous communication, so they have full visibility into, say, what the journeys were sending out on that loan officer's behalf. Now that loan officer can have a high quality conversation without having to look in external systems, without even having to look in uh, LOS for her loan information. So now that loan officer or loan officer assistant can call Ciara, remind her about the relationship you used to have, hopefully stop her from going with another lender, and if needed, log the outcome. Take that pre-populated note or create a task for their loan officer or loan officer assistant. So bottom line, the benefits of using customer intelligence with Total Experts journeys, on average, our organizations, our customers that deploy our best practices with these capabilities, see an improved application to close rate of between 10 and 20%, and on average, they see a 2x improvement on their customer retention.